Hello guys, welcome back to Gamebook Reviews. Today we're here with Liwa. Lewa, le, yeah. Leva, Leva. It's basically a play on words because Leva means live in Sweden, so it's... And it's a Swedish brand, so... Yeah, it's a kind of fun way of uh, pronouncing Leva. Yeah, so this brand was made by a couple of guys from the uh, northern part of Sweden. Norland, as they call it. So, um, I'm... Uh, I'm sort of proud, just like X Gamer, it's a Swedish brand as well. Sort of. It's yeah. been British, it's been passed around a little yeah, it's bit. It's mostly Swedish because there's content and everything is in Swedish and yeah. they're Swedish. The so, yeah. Who, yeah. So, this is the second brand that made the energy pouches, so to say. Yeah, that we sell. There's some new and exciting flavors, a bit more adult, uh, in my opinion, and more mature flavors. And also, they some of these are a bit stronger with 100 milligrams per pouch. Compared to X Gamers, 50 milligrams. They also have some uh, two of these that are 50 milligrams per pouch. So we thought we would start with those as well. So we can see on which wavelength we we're at, so to say. And also when it comes to these pouches, we won't have them uh, in our mouths for too long. Because if we're going to try all of these, we will most likely pass away at this point. I've already drinking way too much caffeine today. Uh, it's like in the afternoon right now. Perhaps I'm fine with uh, half that amount if I keep it just a short while. So yeah, without further ado, let's begin. As we said, we're going to start with the 50 milligrams one. We got both apple sprouse uh, or spruce. I don't know how we pronounce that. Spruce. Spruce. And uh, licorice raspberries. So uh, we'll start with uh, apple spruce. Sprouse, spruce, granbar. They Ooh. smell really, really good. Especially this one. It smells really, really good. And uh, they're sort of brown. Mmm. I don't feel anything yet. I don't know if I'm too dry. That's what she said. That's what she said. Way. You got this like, like candy flavor, but it's pretty mature. It's almost like um, what's it called the red and white stri striped candy. You can see here on the image, uh, polka gris almost. Yeah, a bit like polka. I think I'm too dry. One second. Now when I got, uh, got in a while, uh, I actually taste like a bubblegum flavor, like a V6 or something, like the usual like gum flavor you get, the original ones. And mixed with a little bit of like polka flavor almost. Like it's a weird mix. You get like different notes depending on what like aspect you're thinking of. And it smells really, really good. I think it smells a little bit better than it tastes, but the taste but is that's very... That's usually the thing with uh, pouches. They will always smell better than they taste. It's like uh, when you buy, um, you know, sparkling soda with flavoring. I actually like this one. Uh, it has a very complex flavor. And uh, yeah, I would probably give this one out of 10, uh, maybe an eight a flavor that you can enjoy lo a longer while without getting bored of it so uh, with this one uh, i don't know if it's me or something because i didn't really feel that much flavor or uh, taste so to say i know it's you're not supposed to expect a lot of flavor from this but uh, i did, didn't really expect anything i don't know if it's because they've sort of mixed so 50 percent of them is supposed to taste more like apple and 50 percent of them is supposed to taste more like bruce uh... but i didn't really feel anything yeah. Maybe it's the Corona. Maybe it's the Corona. Yeah, I don't know. I, I'm not really sick. So um, with that said, I think it's just a one off. But uh, if just going from what you said, I would probably give this like a six or something. But uh, I really can't judge right now. So uh, we go with Alex. Well, maybe take the average and take a seven out of ten on this one. We're going to move on to the next one, which is raspberry licorice. That's a very Scandinavian flavor. It's a very popular flavor with most candies and other stuff here in uh, Scandinavia and especially Sweden. Raspberries and licorice. Felix doesn't actually like licorice. That's like the one candy I buy on weekends if I ever buy candy. So yeah, I'm the real Nordic here, not this fake ass shit. <laughs> not a very strong flavor initially. It's starting to creep up. I've been getting more of the raspberry now. Now I'm venturing into the licorice territory. Mm. Uh -uh. Yeah, so right now in my mouth, I got like, like a mix between raspberry and licorice. I guess that's where you failed. Like yeah, I, it, it, 
it will just fell over me a lot of licorice flavor and uh, a bit too strong for my taste. Yeah, I'm no, not a fan of it, so uh, I can't write, rate this too high. Yeah, for me it's like, it's licorice and raspberry, but it's like, for me that enjoys it, it's not very much of either. I would say you definitely get the undertones, like you definitely taste the licorice and raspberry, but it doesn't taste as much like as a candy. But uh, it's a very nice, like, like comfortable, taste in your mouth like a gum or something <laughs> like a gum or something like, uh, yeah <laughs> cool babe. so yeah what would you give this one uh, uh, I, i'm not going to rate this one because i can't leave my uh, my own opinions at the door at, the, at this point because i don't like licorice like at all a lot of pressure here uh, so i'm probably gonna give this one like i like licorice but i don't think i like licorice as much in this form I, i'm more into salt licorice and this tastes that more like sweet licorice so i'm gonna give this one perhaps maybe a seven or six out of ten so now we have another flavor and this is one of the 100 milligram caffeine flavors uh, this is supposed to be winter mint and it and it smells a lot like mint. Oh yeah, that was very, very strong. Uh, mo mo most nicotine pouches in Scandinavia, uh, usually con the mo one of the more popular flavors is usually always mint because it's the most refreshing uh, flavor to like have linger in your mouth, uh, which uh, pouches are supposed to do. It's not something you chew on or anything. So if you're going to go buy something that sort of gives you a good breath as well, you, you might as well choose mint. So it's a very popular um, flavor so to say, when it comes to pouches of any kind here in Scandinavia. So I think this will be more enjoyable. So yeah, here we go. Winter Mint. Ooh, a very strong flavor initially. Like you definitely get this coldness in your mouth. So it's a bit, feel a bit stronger already, both flavor wise and energy wise. I noticed with uh, caffeine energy pouches, you get that energy boost much quicker by absorbing it through the gums than you do by drinking caffeine, uh, in my opinion. So I always say, even though I'm a hardcore caffeine addict and don't really feel energy kicks all that often, I very much do when it comes to these boys. It gets absorbed to your, through your blood uh, much quicker with uh, through your gums, so that's why. With that said, I'm probably not going to get anything different with that right now. It's just basically mint, uh, not spearmint. It's like mint and that uh, that mint that you use on candy canes oh, yeah. and other stuff. Yeah, it actually reminds me of that a lot. Like yeah. the, um, It's those... a combination of different mints. So it's very refreshing and uh, it's a good mint flavor. What would you give this? I would give this a like seven. Like, it's a good mint flavor, it does what it's supposed to. I would rather have a mint flavor when it comes to pouches because it feels refreshing as well. Yeah. And I agree with that and uh, I'm probably gonna give this one an 8 because I really enjoyed the uh, the mint flavor. It gives me this uh, really good breath afterwards. I highly like this one. So now we're gonna move on to the other one. So now we got Liwa cola lime and uh, i'm looking forward to this one because i really love cola and lime and especially cola lime yeah. i'm always looking for uh, coca-cola zero lime but it's always sold out in all the stores i'm at so um, i get or pretty sad or the pepsi lime or the pepsi lime it's basically the same um the comments is gonna f be fuming now. Coca-Cola. Yeah, I I, I prefer Coca-Cola lime, but uh, I've heard uh, people. Uh, I enjoy I enjoy both drinks. I'm not that elitist. I actually but if prefer I, Pepsi. Yeah, but if I'm going to buy one, I'm going to buy cola. So me and Alex, <laughs> we're rivalries. But we've he always doesn't been. like licorice. I like licorice. Yeah, we're, we're opposites. But that's you know opposites attract them. All right. Uh, cola lime. This one is also 100 milligrams. And look here, a bit brownish in Smell color. Test. Oh, it smells like uh, those uh, popsicles. Ooh, yeah, 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 yeah. It doesn't smell a lot like lime, but, but lime... lime don't really smell a lot. Yeah. It's a bit citrusy, but initial lime flavor. Yeah, I gotta say. And then you get like the cola, the popsicle cola flavor. I don't know if it's my mouth that's weird, but uh, yours, you feel the flavors a lot faster than I do. Yeah, because I suck on them. While we're doing a review, if you suck on them, you get the, more of the flavor faster. So we don't want to like spend 10 minutes just waiting for the flavor to come through. But yeah, I get like a nice cola flavor. 
Like initially I got the lime, but right now I don't have as much lime as popsicle. And uh, yeah, that's probably that's probably a good thing. Like more cola flavor, less lime, but it's it's by the bench. It's on the side. It's just like a regular cola lime. Uh, you feel the cola more than the lime, but the lime leaves a more refreshing, um, slightly better aftertaste. I, I quite really enjoy like it. this one. Yeah. What would you give cola lime, Felix? Uh, I would say that's like an 8 out of 10. In terms of the Leva we tried, uh, I'm gonna give this one 9.5 or 10, but uh, yeah, around 9, 10. So, up next we got Spearmint. This is the last flavor and this is also 100 milligrams of caffeine. So Spearmint, Wintermint, there's a slight difference, but I feel like this would probably be a bit stronger. It smells stronger, not as sweet. Yeah, a bit stronger, slightly less friendly mint, if you know what I mean. It's almost like... But it it's get a, g gives a way more refreshing feeling, in my opinion. It's almost like, it's more like a mint gum. It's like a very, very... If you put like three mint gums at the same time in your mouth, and you go outside in the cold, that's almost like it. It's like you get this, whenever you breathe, it just gets really cold and like strong. Yeah, but, but it's not like a chewing gum where the, the coldness fills your whole mouth. It's just, for me, it's specifically around the area where I have the pouch. And uh, I'm not gonna lie, it uh, can sort of slightly sting a little bit. Yeah, but I, I, I actually like that with mint sometimes mm -hmm. because then it feels like something is happening. It's quite exciting flavor. So yeah, uh, what would you give Leva Spearmint? What did we give the winter mint one? I think I gave it like eight. I think I gave it a seven or something, seven, eight. I would give this like the same. It really depends uh, on how strong you want the mint flavor. This one is more minty and less sweet. Yeah, very similar. So uh, yeah, I would probably give this one uh, the same almost. Like there's not much difference, but uh, it's like a small hint of difference. If you like mint, then I would definitely invite you to try both of them and then choose one which you prefer. Both contain 100 milligrams of energy, so on that regard, they're the same. So it just for preference in this case when it comes to mint. So overall, tried all the Leva flavors. That we have, they got more on their site, which we could probably uh, arrange to get to our site as well. Very good flavors. I like the cola lime the most. I think you also did, right? Yes. I feel like these ones were at the top, then came the mint flavors, and lastly the licorice raspberry one. So yeah. If you want to try this out for yourself, we got them both as single packs or 10 packs of each. So make sure to grab them by pressing the link in the description and get yours today. This has been the review guys, hope you enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to press a like and uh, subscribe and press the bell notification button to get notified whenever we upload a new video. Game Bulk out. out.